Hi Capricorns, welcome and welcome back to Prefer Her Tarot. Well, I love to see that you prefer me. We'll about to hop into your reading and see what's going on with you all. Remember that the readings are in general. All of the messages will not resonate with everyone. If you all would like to get a personal reading with me, all of my information is down below. Let's get into this reading, Capricorn. We're going to start off with the overall energy. And then we're going to get into the important messages for you Capricorn. What's the overall energy for the sign of Capricorn, please? Show me my respect. That's what I'm hearing, Capricorn. Show me my respect. Important messages for the sign of Capricorn, please. Thank you. Oh, overall energy first. What's the overall energy, please? And thank you. Whew. We have the seven swords. Let sneaky little devil look you. So we have the hermit card at the bottom of the deck. So you just might be moving in silence, though. Moving in silence. Let's clarify this. Seven of Swords. Could be some sneaky behavior though. Nah. Well. Yeah, I think the way you're coming across is like, mm, I don't know what that person is up to. Six of Pentacles energy clarifying the Seven of Swords. You might be a little weary about what someone's trying to, trying to offer you. The Ten of Wands at the bottom of the deck with the King of Wands. The Eight of Pentacles. Some of you all may have been finding a burden at, to move forward. I don't know why. Because it looks like the work is good, but... Oh, you just need a break. I think some of you all just need a break. And some of you all might be lying to yourselves about... Not lying to yourself. You like some. You like to look out for people, maybe? I don't think you have it to give right now. Damn. I felt that energy. Dang, Capricorn. You don't have it to give right now. You like I ain't, I ain't trying to. It's not to say that no, not to say that you um, don't have the finances or something. I feel like you just don't have the energy to give it right now, and you might just keep saying yes. Do 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 do. The goat. I can't remember the very first message that I see it. Um. Wow. Most important messages for Capricorn. So we have the King of Swords. So if people feel like. You've been coming across cold, stern, um, do it my way or the highway type of energy. It's because you are freaking tired. And um, you might not be able to say that to these people. <laughs> you are my rock. Um, you might be the rock for these people. But I also see a connection that you might not want to be in anymore. Or someone is choosing a certain person. I don't know. But let me get some more messages for you, Capricorn. The Seven of Cups, confused. You might have a lot of different choices that you, could, you can choose from. But, um, like, I literally feel this energy of exhaustion right now. It's kind of early right now. So, I feel it. So, you don't, you're you doing, but you, you are exhausted. And that's why you might be coming across a little mean. Don't be an angry bird, though, okay? Seven of Cups, energy, confused, unsure, mixed emotions, right? This hanging man is at the bottom of the deck, seeing a different perspective um some of you all feel like you're not being fulfilled right that what goes back to like you're exhausted you're giving it to people yeah yeah you feel like you're not being fulfilled you need to take a vacation baby just take a vacation okay so more messages i'm hearing easy for you to say more messages for the sign of Capricorn. We have a magician card. Um, you know what else I'm hearing? Some of you all, it's, it's, it's best to take a vacation with the right person. It doesn't have to be an intimate, connect, you know, or, yeah. It doesn't have to, have to be sexual or anything like that. It could just be a friend, right? Because intimacy could, it's like friendship too, right? I'm not going to just cut the read to go look up. The actual definition definition of intimacy because I think it was more like a deeper connection, right? It doesn't necessarily have to be romantic. That's what I was looking for. It doesn't have to be romantic to be intimate. All right, moving forward. So take the take a trip with the right person. Three of Swords energy, hurt, heartbreak, pain, holding on to something. You might be holding on to a little hurt too. I think I was just selling towards that. Yeah, holding on to a little bit of hurt. All we're trying to manifest. 
you know, it's that it's that saying, um, I don't even know how I'm gonna do this. So I'm here. I don't even know how I'm gonna do this. Cause you might be tired here. Got a lot to do, a lot going on. I don't even know how I'm gonna do this. Oh, time for me to go eat my bed. My bed. <laughs> but let me get this ready done. More messages for the sign of Capricorn. Yo, there you go. But at the same time, I don't like to just Oh, Capricorn, there you go. The devil again. You ain't you ain't, you always up to no good type ish. That's not the way I come across with this uh with the Capricorns at all. To be honest. Because of the energy that you're coming from with giving to people and you might not be um uh, being respected or things are being reciprocated to a certain extent. Um, you might be manifesting from a lower vibration instead of your higher self, okay? But we do have the Wheel of Fortune at the bottom of the deck and a death card. <sighs> times are changing, but let the good times roll. I hold, heard both of those things. So what's the King of Swords? At this point, what did I do? Y'all, wait. I'm just thinking about this. I made me something to eat and did not eat. What am I thinking? What is the King of Swords? <laughs> you. I'm thinking like you right now. Taking care of everything else. Doing something else. Thinking about something else. And not even taking care of myself. Stop acting like you all good. And you got it to give right now. But I'm doing this reading because I was supposed to get to it. It just is what it is. I'm behind on my work. But I do have I have to go and eat. Take care of myself. Um, <laughs> Six of Wands. Energy clarifying the King of Swords. Success. Right. Your mind is focused on success. Exactly. We on the same page. We on the same page. Two of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck. King of Pentacles, Knight of Pentacles, Pentacles. There you go. You like, look, love can wait later. That, that, it can wait till later. But right now, I'm focused on success. I'm trying to build. But at the same time, let me tell you this. And I'm just being honest, Capricorn. That's um, manifesting from what I'm seeing. And when it comes down to the rebalancing of the earth, it's low-key manifesting from a lower side. Because we're not appreciating oneself, appreciating the things around us, appreciating the people who truly love us. Because we simply... We simply Looking for uh, success, success, or money, 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 money. It comes down to greed. It comes down to greed. Dry yourself, just dry, uh, drive yourself dry or run yourself dry so you can get to a type of energy, to be successful, to be noticed, to be recognized type of energy. We got to be mad for that, okay? So what's the si seven of cups energy? So there's a need for reciprocation. What's the seven of cups energy? Or just take care of yourself. Seven of Pentacles. So we have two sevens here. We have the Queen of Wands at the bottom of the deck and the Nine of Swords. Like the things that you really want to do, you haven't been doing them. You've been, you've been kind of like worried about doing them or something like that. You could be low key worried about a. What's that? Um, Sag, Aries, Leo energy. What's the Magician card? But some of you are. Excuse me. I wondered if you should continue to invest into something or someone, maybe. But Page of Swords energy on top of the Magician card. Dang, that is true though. Manifesting out of immaturity. Because just like I was just speaking about whatever I was speaking about, some of you all and some people may not be receptive to that that message, right? Because some people will be like, oh, that's a broke person's message. You ain't got enough money. Money made me happy. Whatever. Hey, look respect <laughs> appreciation value care all of that stuff over money right yes it makes it it makes life easier but you got to have those other things that saying one of my favorite sayings you so broke all you have is money let's not be one of those people okay um manifesting out of the state of immaturity so oh look at this wow the high priest is at the bottom of the deck with the fab of Wands. I was confused at the Fab of Wands coming out um, in the Taurus reading. Not necessarily confused, but I couldn't quite put my finger on it. And then I figured it out. It's about, um, it was about taking the wrong advice to a certain extent. And that's what I get here. Where you may realize that, damn, the advice that I was taking is not the best advice. May have gotten you in a, in a, in a, in a position where you felt trapped. And it's time to get yourself out of that energy, right? What's the double card? 
Knight of Wands in reverse, chaos, going crazy, moving which way, every way. Ten of Wands, creating a more burden, not only for yourself, but others as well. That's, that's possible. Possible. Moving that way. All for the means of what? Success. Start to destroy everything around you. A lot of people, I mean, not a lot of people. It, it, it happens, though. When you think about the way of the world, that happens. They destroy every, They destroy. Some people destroy everything in their way. Don't give a damn about no one, anyone else, or in the or the long run. But what they could get in that moment, what they have their eye on, manifesting out of immaturity. But anyway, um, what's the advice? So, we have the moon card, and then we have the two of cups in reverse. There's not a meeting of the minds, maybe with someone, other individuals. The moon card may be being afraid, needing to pay attention to your dreams. You might be in having, you might be having, ooh, you might be having these conversations with others. Like I don't relate to these people no longer. I don't want to do these things. I'm lying to myself, saying I'm fulfilled by doing this. Some people don't want to be used. So want to be some people want to be appreciated for who they truly are. Two of Cups in reverse. It's not. It's not two individuals respecting one another for who they are. It's like one side of situations and stuff. The Moon card. Let me clarify it. Clarify the Moon card, please, and thank you, Cancer, Pisces energy, uh, Ten of Swords. Right, acting like he's nothing wrong. <laughs> acting like you fulfilled. Yeah, that's what I'm seeing here. Acting like oh, I don't care about the long term. I'm, I'm worried about the moment type of energy. Some of you are like tired of the, the, the dibble and dabbing. This person here, that person there. Like some people are tired of that. I see that. Not really relating, sleep with a person, but don't care to be next to this person in the morning. Don't care to cuddle with them type of shit. Yeah, I'm finna stop. Yeah, cool. that was your reading. Um, just pay attention to your dreams. Pay attention to what your body is telling you, what source is telling you. If you need to end something dead, it, why continue to betray yourself and others and create chaos around you or whatnot? I hope you all enjoyed the reading. Let me know down in the comments. If it resonated, how it resonated, leave like, share, all of that good stuff. I love you all that love me, and I'll see you all next time. Bye.